This evening, we're discussing a radical reinterpretation of Rolf Harris's recorded works, which many now believe to be fixated with masturbation and bestiality. Joining me in the studio is Dr. Daniel Kneecaps, author of the paper, Rolf Harris, Literally a Wanker. Good evening, Donald. What specifically have you found in Rolf's songs that alludes to bashing the bishop? The examples are legion, and start with his earliest known work, Timey Kangaroo Downsport. If I may just play you a section... Timey Kangaroo Downsport, Timey Kangaroo Down... Timey Kangaroo Downsport, Timey Kangaroo Down... Play your didgeridoo, blue... Play your didgeridoo... Uh, like... Keep playing till I shoot through blue. Play your didgeridoo all together now. Time me kangaroo down, sport. Time me kangaroo down. Time me kangaroo down, sport. Now here he asks you to play his didgeridoo blue. The didgeridoo is a straightforward phallic metaphor, being a rigid tube that you cup to your mouth made of solid wood. Indeed, woody is an American slang term for an erection of the male member. His use of the word blue also alludes to overt sexual practices, as we see in terms such as blue movie. My interpretation goes beyond the point of questionability when we hear the ejaculatory follow-up line Keep playing till I shoot through blue. I think we all know what that means. Can you be certain that you are not misinterpreting this song? Putting sordid images onto an expression of innocent fun? <laughs> Certainly not! We must ask why we've never before been concerned at the words timey kangaroo downsport, which have no other clear meaning. The obvious issue for consideration is to what end he wishes a kangaroo to be tied down for him. The implication is that he wishes to perform some act from which a kangaroo at liberty would undoubtedly flee. What this act might be is matter for further research, but it does make one suspicious about this man, a cartoonist and entertainer by trade, all of a sudden being involved in Animal Hospital, with its ready supply of captive and helpless animals. Have you found further examples? Oh, indeed, Brian. Many, many. Far too many. The number one hit, Two Little Boys, pretty well speaks for itself. Two little boys had two little toys Each had a wooden horse Gaily they played each summer's day Warriors both, of course This song is an heady, homoerotic barrage of precocious sexuality finding expression through mutual masturbation Two little boys had two little toys I think we know what he means there, but he confirms and clarifies it with each had a wooden horse. The term wood recurs, and the horse is almost a cliché of potent Freudian sexual metaphor. He continues, gaily they played each summer's day. The homosexuality is not even shrouded in a metaphoric reference here, and then there's the fetishism of Anne Summers being brought into the matter as well. I understand that in the course of your research, you uncovered some more of this direct masturbation material. Yes. During his time in the studio recording Jake the Peg, a song paying an homage to a well-endowed individual and his so-called extra leg... Quite, quite. Rolf recorded an extraordinary spoken word narrative of beginner's masturbation techniques. He had hoped to make it into a full album, but the record company unceremoniously pulled the plug on the project after hearing the first lesson. I have obtained a copy of the one recorded lesson, and I have it with me here today. Well, let's hear, for the first time on radio, Rolf Harris's beginner's masturbation classes. Masturbating. Fucking anybody can achieve this in seconds by simply touching your organ. <laughs> well, that's fairly obvious, isn't it? You know, the ideal way to get the most enjoyment out of a penis 
Just imagine it's you and your family or your friends getting together and fucking a group of enthusiastic 14-year-olds. Oh, 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 yeah. Anyway, by placing your free hand on top of it and moving it up or down, you're well on the way to coming. There you go. Almost unbelievable. Incidentally, I haven't mentioned this, but I'm holding you penis and moving it in various ways. Relax, Ralph. <coughs> Don't get carried away now. <coughs> Settle down. So, what a little bit of practice coming can do, you can produce pure organ enjoyment. Now, away we go.